Did T-Rex shake the ground when it walked? Now, this is a video that I've wanted to make for quite some time now, and I've seen a little bit of on Twitter discussing this very topic. Now, in the movie Jurassic Park, let's face it, when the T-Rex breaks out of the fence, the enclosure, it is spectacular. It is probably my favorite moment in all of movie history. And those giant earth-shattering footsteps that the T-Rex takes are unforgettable. And in the movie theater back in 93, you know, those steps shook the entire movie theater and made the experience what it was. But did the real animal make footsteps like that? Now, obviously, that's a movie. And I don't think any animal on Earth, walking on Earth, being bound by gravity, would make that type of monstrous steps, no matter how big it was. So obviously it's exaggerated. But, you know, it's this idea of, did T-Rex give the ground a minor jolt even when it moved around? Now, that depends upon a lot of things, meaning was it running, was it walking? Um, from what I've read and talking to a bunch of different people on Twitter, you know, the overall consensus seems to be that it's a predator. And as a predator, it would be, try to be as silent as possible. I mean, you don't want to be alerting others that you're in the area. You want to be quiet. Now, there may have been some times when the ground received a little jolt. Let's face it, T-Rex weighed almost 20,000 pounds that we know of. You know, there's that study that T-Rex could be 70% bigger, but for right now, um, a large T-Rex is considered around 20,000 pounds. So, you know, it's this idea that it's a predator, and as a predator, you want to be silent. You don't want to be alerting everybody as to you're in the area. You know, think about the Serengeti in Africa. Most kills are kind of done in silence. Now, obviously, lions and things like that, a pride of lions or even a Bengal tiger, things like that, they're nowhere near the size of T-Rex, so obviously they're not going to shake the ground. But just consider the fact that their pursuits and when they take animals down, it usually happens by them being quiet. They don't go around roaring and alerting the entire Serengeti or the entire area as to their presence. Usually they sneak up and once they make the commitment, they go for it. But they don't go blazing roars and announcing their presence. It's kind of down in silence. Now, I like to think the footsteps would have been the same thing, meaning it would have been as quiet as it possibly could when it was stalking prey. And, you know, who knows? Again, this is all speculative. We've never seen a dinosaur. We're never going to be able to go back in time. So, again, very speculative, but I like to believe that T-Rex would have been as quiet as possible, and there may have been certain times in a hunt or in its life when it did shake the ground just with its sheer weight. But the nature of it, I believe, would have wanted to be as quiet as possible because it needs to eat. It's a predator. If it doesn't eat, you know, it's going to die. So curious all of your thoughts on that. And this is something I've wanted to make for quite a while. I've been reading about it, and I just haven't had a time to get around to do a video. But it's an interesting topic nonetheless. And, you know, it really just points to this idea of you're a predator, and you're going to want to be as successful as you can. And being successful probably means being as quiet as you can. I also believe that T-Rex did roar. You know, it roared. But do I think it went around bursting out of the trees and just blasting a roar for all the year? No. Um, think about lions and tigers again. They will release big, yawning, moaning roars from time to time. But again, in a hunt, when they're pursuing, probably not. This is probably more when they're eating or maybe as a mating call or maybe to um, detract others. So, again, I feel like roaring and footsteps, they're kind of linked in one in that you want to be quiet if you're a predator. You don't want to alert things as to your presence. Enough for me, though. And forget about leaving this video a like. Love to hear what you'd have to say in the comments section below. If you have an opinion on this, did T-Rex shake the ground when walking? Drop us a comment in the comment section below. Love to hear your thoughts on this. Take care.